Wallaby Dick. It's a beautiful day down here at Coles Bay. I have some uh, company with me here today. We've got Freya and Abdel. You. Someone is the birthday boy tomorrow. Woo. Are you excited? Very. Just gonna get another year older and a lot more years wider. Punching well, closer to 40 every year that goes by. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, he's definitely been behaving the last couple of days like he's on his birthday. He's marinating, he's entered the marination station, including that ice cream that he's sucking down right now. <laughs> We are off today to go and hunt the elusive spider crab. They have currently come inshore very close for shedding and I'm not too sure if they do come in for mating, but they definitely come in to shed in the thousands. The great thing is that it's easy pickings. So that means that we can go and take 15 under my rock lobster license, fishing within the rock lobster license season. And we can take 15 home for us to eat. And uh, 15 sets of legs is going to hopefully provide a fair chunk of meat for us to get through. This underwater footage that I'm going to show you shortly is phenomenal. These guys just pile on top of each other and it's just crazy. They go for hundreds of meters, all just piled together. So I've got a couple of quick hours up our sleeve. Let's go and I'll show you something very cool. Thanks for tuning in. So we can see all of the crabs have actually shelled. It was quite literally yesterday that we were here. Who knows if they're still gonna be here. I think just getting in the water and hunting around is gonna be the best bet. So without further ado, let's jump in. We'll see if we can find them. Not as many there today as what there were yesterday. Wasn't it crazy how many were bundled up yesterday? It was nuts. There were thousands. Absolutely. Thousands. But we've got ourselves a feed. What we're going to do with these, because I'm not using the shell, I'm just going to use the legs, chuck them in a pot this evening, eat them up for dinner, and uh, yeah, we'll see how they taste. A lot of people say, and I agree, that they taste sweeter than crayfish, so I'm not complaining here. The legs are delicious. We tried it last night. What did you think? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we've, we've been spoiled this season with <laughs> cray as well, so we're not complaining. But this was something different, and it's definitely a little bit sweeter. It's good. Right, that's a little wrap until we get them off the boil.
Now this phenomenon of all of the spider crabs usually happens entering into winter down here in Tasmania. Just to clarify, there is a bag limit of 15 species combined with male and female. The possession limit is 30 species combined. And there is no minimum size between the male and the female. So they do not weigh up against the giant crab, which have a 150 millimeter minimum size for the females and 140 millimeter minimum size for the males. You can take 15 of these with a possession limit of 30. That's all I have for you on the spider crab migration, which is pretty sensational if you ask me. Here is some additional footage of some striped trumpeter that we caught over the weekend. Oh. What do you got? Really? Oh, nice There's one. Some down. There should be some stripey down there then. Yeah. Getting these, we are in the right spot. It's a more one. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty decent size one too on the vexed. First time I've used this vexed. 150 gram. That'll play. Put them in here. We're in the zone. That's 25, easy. That is a nice size Moe. Beauty. Another Moe bites the dust. Andrew has finally found a stripey on the new electric combo. And it is definitely undersized. <laughs> 55 centimeters is yeah, the goal no, for this. I think we could give him a measure just out of curiosity because a lot of them have been this big lately. Oops, and sorry. <laughs> this is how short we are. Oh dear. All right. Straight um, back with a couple of cod. It has been a very slow glass out day off the east coast of Tassie. We've tried heading out wide and catching some swordfish. No luck. We've tried for blue eye. No luck. So what we're doing now is dropping for stripey. Fingers crossed we can just redeem our day and get onto something. We've just got one on the electric combo, the new Shimano 9000. I'm just going to wind up some bait. Fingers crossed we can make something happen. Maybe, just maybe, I've found the target species. A few head shakes going on. We've got dolphins flying around us everywhere. It's beautiful. Missed a couple of taps. And it's taking the bait after letting it sit there a bit longer. We must be getting close. This is going to be so embarrassing if it's not what I think it is. It looks like it's got like a nice And you know what? There's a stripey there. Oh. Another stripey. Gosh, that looks beautiful coming up out of the water right now. My main priority is measuring whether or not that is 55 centimeters. So we can get him back in the drink. If it's not, he is going to go straight back down. He's got plenty of fight left in him. <laughs> Mm, yeah, he's fine. Yeah, he's doing a little spiral. He's gone down to the bottom. He's out of there. Well, another stripey hits the deck. Pity they're not size. 25. <gasps> you beauty! <sighs> oh, yeah, mate! <sighs> All right. That was down. very, very difficult to get off the bottom just then. I'm so serious. That fought so hard. I saw, mate. The you don't need the gaff. Don't worry about it. The you get the rod tip bit back around. Oh man, he just. That was sick. He hit the bottom, sorry. 
Oh, Artie was just trying to get back down, but he's dropped a bit of weight now. He is a nice size stripey. That, that is a keeper. Oh, look at that beauty! Oh, come I'm here, sorry. come on. Finally! Give me <laughs> you did it! Oh dear, that's a nice size one too. That is God, fantastic. What a pretty fish! Yes. Epic! What a great fight too, man! Well over 55, probably 60 on this. She's a lovely size stripe. <laughs> on the bait rig. Nothing on the jig yet, but that was a beautiful, beautiful fight. <laughs> That's a good fish. Look at the bend on that. That is a great fish. Might need to come over near you, Andrew. Yeah. Uh, I think I've got one on it anyway, actually. Yeah. Are you sure? I, I'm just worried that we might be tangled because I was out there for a bit. I reckon we're tangled because I'm I'm, uh, I'm I'm really aimed towards you a fair bit here. Really? Yeah. Can I can come over the top, we can switch. Let me just I'll let you know quite soon. There is some crazy things happening down there right now. Oh man. That's so caught up, but okay, just keep let's it. get that stripe again. Take it easy, easy. Ah, there him. you go. All right. All right. All right. Bail arm open. Bail arm open. Okay, I'm gonna pop, plop him here. You can walk back. Yeah. Yeah. Another stripe bay. I got something on the other end there. Yeah. That is oversized. That's great.